Yeah, hi there. These comments are for, I think it's, uh, yeah, Caesar. Okay, so let's take a look at the email that you sent to me. You say, hi, Michael, this is Caesar from Mexico. I'd like to take your TOEFL online course, but I have a question. Since I don't know my English level, I think is intermediate. I must have to take a quick preparation before taking your online course. Thank you for answering. Uh, no, I don't think you need to do that. Uh, here's probably what you want to do. If you're intermediate level and not advanced, uh, I would recommend that you focus in the first three sections of my course for the first month or two. For example, you can focus in the vocabulary, pronunciation, and the grammar sections for maybe month one and two. And then the next month, you can focus on the reading and the listening parts of my course. And then for your final month, you can focus on the speaking and the writing sections. So if you use my course based on your current English level for approximately four months, you should be able to advance your English from intermediate level to advance. Now what you didn't say is what score you want to get and what your current TOEFL score is. But I can tell you this, uh, normally students who diligently and I emphasize the word diligently, students who diligently use my online course uh, each day throughout the month, they generally will increase their overall TOEFL score 5 to 10 points. So, for example, if your TOEFL score right now is 60 and you work really, really hard this first month following my suggestions, then you should have a good chance of getting close to 70 by the end of the month. And then again, for the second month, if you work really, really hard and you study diligently, you should be able to get closer to 80 on that second month. But it's hard work. It really is. So remember that I am only an email away. Uh, once you join my TOEFL course, you probably should complete my diagnostic pretest for my pronunciation section. I think that's going to be a really good idea for you. And you also want to begin immediately studying the vocabulary words in my section one. That's really the hardest part of my course, is learning the words in the first section. I have dozens and dozens of practice tests to help you learn the words, but I also recommend, Caesar that you buy some note cards. You can go to Walmart or some type of store that sells school supplies. Get some of these note cards, something like this where you can write the word on one side and then on the other side of the sheet of paper you can put a definition, a sample sentence and the meaning of that word and you really do need to begin studying my vocabulary words by using note cards alright anyway thank you very much for contacting me I hope I've given you some answers to your questions and all the best to your high scoring TOEFL success